Hello everyone, this is Mang and Kirsty's story so far. I'm going to try not to keep turning around. Um, before, before Clean Easy, I was working as a bricklayer and Kirsty was working in a bar. So nothing like this, we've never done anything like this before. Now this is where our story is a little different because we decided to jump in full time straight away. We're seeing this as an opportunity to change your life. So that's how we decided to go about it. That's similar to how, that's my first day, Clean Easy there. <laughs> Um, I remember I went to my mum's house and I said, I've got a thousand catalogues coming, I'm going to do Clean Easy full time. And she looked at me like I told her I was going to join the circus. <laughs> she, she didn't believe it. But we didn't listen, we had a goal, the goal was to build as quickly as possible, replace the full time income. So the plan was to put out 1,500 catalogues a week, and that's what we did, in and out as much as possible. People ask how many hours that took, and I don't know, I didn't count, it doesn't matter. What matters is we had 10% in the first four days, we had 13 and 15% in the first period, personally retailed over 2,700, we picked up 160 plus customers, and my first check was £810. So, so, so who now is going to tell me this business doesn't work? Well, it turns out everybody. No, they still didn't believe it. I got this note from a random blanket drop, you know, 800 pounds a load of rubbish, give it six months and you'll be out. Well, you'll see what happened, in, you'll see in a minute what happened in six months, and I made that 800 pound my first month, so they, don't, they obviously don't know what they're talking about. And you react two ways when you get negativity like this. You can feel sorry for yourself and go home and quit, and they'll never let you forget it, and you'll always regret not making it work. Or you can do what all the successful people in the room have done, and you can say, right, I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna make this work. That's what we decided to do. So it was hard work at times. The van looked at every morning. The sitting room turned to a warehouse once a week. But it didn't matter because we're building a business, we're building a future, we're seeing it. And the checks went up every month. This was in the first couple of months. Within the first four to five months, we're starting to replace a full-time income. There's less people sort of taking the mick now and more people asking what, I'm, what we're doing. Now the business was going along nicely, but we never were well, aiming for gold, but we never really had a set like time, you know. And then we got some news that we're going to be parents again for the second time. Exciting news, but also very expensive. <laughs> so I'm panicking, we need to grow this business even quicker. So six and a half months in, we messaged Harvey and Tracy, and the confidence they had in us gave us the belief we could go and do it. And we did. We personally retailed over six thousand pound, we teamed it three and a half, and we hit gold. That's what gold looks like there. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> Amazing feeling, proud moment. But the best part for me is, it doesn't, this is just the start, it doesn't end here. We know how good this feels. Now it's our job to help as many people as possible achieve this same thing. And what an amazing business to allow you to do that. And that was with check after seven months, almost trebled with our income and replaced full-time wage. So no going back to work now. So, and that was, <laughs> that doesn't happen every week, honestly. That, <laughs> that was a Christmas time. We wanted a, a week off at Christmas, but we couldn't afford to take, you know, just not put catalogs out. So we'll put two weeks worth of base into one. And if anyone wonders what three grand retail in a week looks like, <laughs> that's it there. We're still delivering that now. <laughs> But what, what this really means is we've got a customer base now that we've built and it's not going anywhere. It's a, you know, income producing asset and it allows us more time freedom now. I take my daughter to school every morning. <coughs> I've never... <laughs> I've never been able to do that. My top tips, now these are very simple. Um, but for me it's a simple business so you can overcomplicate it. The numbers count. The more you do, the better it is, you know, the faster it'll move. And don't kid yourself saying you haven't got time. You can make time. You can make, you've just got to give up some telly, give up some sleep, whatever it takes to make it work. Set big, big goals and aim high. Now, like, that's what we're doing. We're setting goals every period. We've got long-term goals and we're aiming high. Follow your successful upline. Well, we're part of the Shooting Stars group, who's part of the Star Group International. And... Um, if we, want to, 
if we want a business like Harvey and Tracy and like Helen and Paul, then doesn't it make sense just to do what they've done and copy what they do? It's, just, it's really that simple, just duplicate what they're doing and we'll have the business that they've got. Our goals for this year is bronze executive by the end of the year, four grand monthly check, the free catalogs which we've had, the, 50, the, the check which we'll get soon, the 10 grand bonus, this is a big one for this because we want to go to Disneyland with the kids, so that's a big long-term goal. And help as many people as possible achieve what we're achieving because that's the best part about this business. And it's all right me saying I want all those things, we want all those things, we do, but everybody does. But the difference is we're prepared to work for them, we're prepared to learn what we need to learn and we want to make it happen. So, and this is a quote I like, it's tough right now, you know, it, it, it can be tough building, but when everything feels like an uphill struggle, think of the view from the top. How amazing is it going to be when we get there and achieve what we want to achieve and can spend more time as a family and I, can, I kind of found clean easy enough for that. And that's me, thank you for listening. Thanks. Yeah.